for Solaris, your local veteran-owned solar battery storage, roofing, and heating and AC installer. <laughs> solar panels on sale. Tesla power walls on sale. End phase batteries on sale. Everything is on sale. The more you buy, the more you save. Jane in Temecula needs 22 panels and two power walls. She'll save 2,700 on panels, 3,000 on Tesla power walls, $500 military discount, $500 downloadable coupon, saving her $6,700. John needs 15 panels and one power wall. He'll save $4,000. Add in the 30% solar federal tax credit plus zero down, 0% interest and zero payments till 2025. There's never been a better time to go solar than right now. Call now or visit SemperSolaris.com. This just in. For a limited time, get an additional $500 off the Tesla Powerwall. Nature's Own is never made with any artificial flavors or preservatives. Dive in. Dive in. But it's scary. It's tomato soup. What did you think? So every meal ends happily ever after. NBC4 News at 5 starts with breaking news. That breaking news is in the Hollywood Hills where a brush fire threatened homes this afternoon. Hello and thanks for joining us. I'm Kathy Varen. And I'm Jonathan Gonzalez. Let's get up to Eliana Moreno who's over the area in News Chopper 4. And Eliana, we know firefighters, they were able to make quick work of this one, but there were some tense moments this afternoon. And Jonathan, you mentioned that those tense moments was uh, was when that fire got very close to four very large homes here in the Hollywood Hills, just off of Laurel Canyon and Hollywood Boulevard. You can see the fire department uh, is uh, just putting the final touches here on this fire. But again, this uh, broke out at about one o'clock. It was a small brush fire on this hill that you see here. And of course, uh, fires tend to burn faster uphill than downhill. And right in the path of those flames were these four very large homes. But thanks to good brush clearance, firefighters were able to keep the flames at bay and keep it just to the brush. Now, even though the fire is out, this is still having an impact here on the area because Laurel Canyon Boulevard, which is a major street here through the area, is shut down from Hollywood Boulevard over to Mulholland. That is the very latest here from the Hollywood Hills in News Chopper 4. I'm Eliana Moreno. Let's head back down to you in the studio. Eliana, can you tell us exactly how long you think that thoroughfare is going to be closed? Because I know it's a very popular one and people want to get through there, especially on a Saturday night. What do you know about the timeline? So what we're hearing, Kathy, is that two hours ago, the fire department estimated that it would only be the area of the traffic. So I'm sure this is narrow roads trying to find. at a major street the area is uh, shut down and it's been shut down now uh, since one o'clock so the last several hours but at this point I am still seeing that one fire truck here I'm still seeing of course some cones uh, so I believe that as soon as that fire truck clears out then we will be able to reopen up everything but it should still take I'd say at least another 15 to 30 minutes all right, Eliana, thank you so much. We're going to show you a different view right now as we head over to Malibu because firefighters are dealing more with more than just this fire right here in the Hollywood Hills. This is an extreme weekend of heat, and meteorologist Stephanie Olmo has details with your first alert forecast. Stephanie. Hey, Kathy, the past several days, we've been talking about the warm up here this weekend, and here it is. We have heat advisories that remain in place throughout portions of the Inland Empire, San Bernardino, stretching down into Temecula and also up into the San Fernando Valley, Santa Clarita, even stretching back throughout portions of Ventura County. So temperatures here today and also as we head into tomorrow, because this advisory will last until tomorrow evening, will be in the 90s, even some triple digit heat, especially inland areas, of course. Watch for heat related illnesses. Want to make sure to hydrate and stay cool right now. This is a live view of the San Fernando Valley where we're looking at a mostly clear sky right now. Temperatures in Burbank. You're currently sitting at a warm 90 degrees. Temperatures about six degrees warmer now compared to this time yesterday. Let's check out some other spots. Right now we're sitting at 100 degrees in San Bernardino, 101 in Lancaster, mid 90s in Van Nuys, 84 in Thousand Oaks, low 70s in LAX, so a little bit more comfortable in areas along the coast, 71 in Oxnard, 84 in Long Beach, 89 in Anaheim. 
Over in West Covina, your temperature is 90 degrees. As we check out the satellite and radar, uh, as you see, we're looking at mostly clear skies, really not a cloud in sight across the region here, so that's pretty nice. And as we zoom on out, Here's the weather pattern. This is what we have going on. High pressure system nearby just to the southeast of us, and this is actually promoting